Um, it's DJ Diesel and Sultan, Dawn of the Dead, featuring Shaquille O'Neal. So DJ Diesel is in there two times. <laughs> He's also featured. Yeah, and the remixer. Also, he produces the VIP in the future. <laughs> you know Sultan? Like, uh, you are pretty familiar with his stuff, right? I, I know his music, yeah. Uh, I don't know him personally. Okay. I thought somehow that you do. Um, no. His music is pretty dope, I gotta say. Oh yeah, I agree on that. To represent light. To be the creator of the universe and the source of life, he must breathe the Osiris myth. To be dead and the underworld means eternal. So it's so funny to me to hear these shock vocals saying Did something I, I epic. I see him, I see him yeah. on this fucking cliff. Yeah, you in this like Roman Empire armor just standing there like yeah. Hercules being like and he's better. And it's for me this is so funny because I was listening to the freaky and DJ Diesel call up and the Holly's all he said was something like, We're gonna break your back headbang, something like that, you know? Like th these type of vocals, and now he's like trying to to tell a story like about something that's blah 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 with Egypt and that people and I don't know. Thank you for the sub, Kenjin. Um, and dude, life is hard for vocalists, dude. Life is hard. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I think so. It's I just can't your fucking neck. I the ancient Egypt. <laughs> yeah, I just can't really take it serious from him because I see his face and he's like such a cute guy, like Shaq. Alvin wants to skip the in-game dialogue. <laughs> <laughs> Forced cutscene is so nice. <laughs> Forced cut. Fuck. It sounds so good though. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's let's not talk shit. Okay. No. <laughs> he who represents really darkness so cannot represent light. To be the creator of the universe and the source of life, he must breathe the Osiris myth. To be dead and the underworld means eternal power. Worship for all of eternity. He is the Sultan of Gods. <laughs> Yeah, dude, Chuck made the vocal, and I didn't All expect right. like a like a big room melody coming in now. <laughs> I was I was just so confused you know, like, through through three genres in one <laughs> second. <laughs> dude, you know what I just realized? It came out on fucking spinning records. Oh. Oh well, then. It then makes now, now it makes now sense. I, now I expect the big room thing. I also now like the vocals make even more sense because like these vocals sound really they yeah. fit the entire like the hardcore hard bass kind of hard style. Like these that's yeah, big room, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, big room. Big yeah, that's the word. Um, big room. <laughs> something you could expect right now might be Psytrance or something. Oh, someone just yeah. wrote that, Paul. Oh, hard style. I thought. I thought yeah. Oh, please, no I mean, hard style. It, it could be. Maybe it's good hard style. I, some hard style is really dope. It's, it's no. Yes. <laughs> yes. My opinion is more valid, definitely. That was France, right? Yeah, that's France. Yeah. <laughs> it's France. <laughs> so it's DJ Diesel and Sultan, Down of the Dead, featuring Shaquille O'Neal and France from Attila. Every, Bitch. Dude, every, every, 
<laughs> every vocal that ends with bitch is France. Stop, stop table dancing like a bitch. Stop. <laughs> Can't. <laughs> All right. That's not bad at all. <laughs> That's fucking fire. The bitch. So there's this one tone that makes like this wow noise, like right at the beginning yeah. from the, that sounds fucking mm -hmm. sick. Yeah, yeah, I think also the the how it's like syncopated and goes like little off grid. That's mm -hmm. really cool. Mm -hmm. This is like this is fucking smacking like a bitch. It's really really good. Uh, Kenjin, like uh, bitch. Quiet and Inhuman Collab coming out next month actually. Oh yeah. Uh, this That's month true. actually. Oh yeah, yeah, that might also be true. I don't know what day it is. Yeah. No. It, oh, this yeah, it's the first. Of, oh, it's the first of April. Yeah. <laughs> Jokes on you. It's not coming out. <laughs> it's not coming out at all. <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> no, this is. I, it's pretty good, it's right? Not, Joke day. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, it's a good song. <laughs> Yo. I mean, that's fucking oh, sick. <laughs> you're spinning records. Yeah, I'm confused. Like a bitch. A bitch. <laughs> bitch. Just a little Franz that's... popping in in the screen for a second. Bitch. Oh, I, I have been melting. Dude. That is fucking insane. Yeah, yeah, I like it. The sound I, design like, and production is so on point. Dude, this is the first April, first April song, dude. For, like, you just like, oh, yeah, this this spinning record song. Oh, yeah. It has like this big room melody at the beginning. And yeah. And typical hard style intro. And then it just goes like machine gun triplet. It's like how to actually make a really dope first April joke. <laughs> yeah. Nice, eh? I like it. Imagine the second drop is just hard style now. <laughs> <laughs> be like, <laughs> April Fool's. <laughs> this song doesn't exist. Okay, so here's a funny thing. I have a theory. Don't have a theory like a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, but for real. You know how this sounds? The song was finished. The complete song was finished without Shaq, you know? That's why the front vocal is in there. And then Shaq was like, yeah, let's make a song together. We could put it on, on uh, spinning because I know them or whatever. And then they built like this little intro before that. Because there's no vocal from Shaq in this song at all. Oh, it's just like at they, the beginning. Does Shaq produce? I'm not sure, actually. I don't think so. Maybe he, maybe he does produce. I'm not sure, honestly. Uh, like, I'm, I, I know too little about Shaq to like yeah. say anything. It just really. feels like that because the little vocal is just at the beginning, you know. Um, maybe, maybe he produced something. Yeah. Maybe he didn't. I don't like. Yeah, maybe. It yeah. Like DJ Diesel and Sultan and then featuring Shaq. So why yeah, would true. Feature featuring Shaq, true. right? That kind of so indicates that he at least put like that some he did thought into it. Stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So he maybe like produced stuff with him and then they were like, we could make an intro before that and then they put the intro before it. You but yeah, let, it, like, let's listen to anything. the song. Enough negativity here. Yeah.
honestly, it's so fire with the melody in the background. Play, play that again. Yeah. Yeah, man. And I like this a lot. Like the sound design is so this dope. Is, this is fucking insane. Yeah. Like all and these little details. So good. All these little details Especially on the second the, drop. The triple drop at the end, man. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Ah. I also I also love Connor Naughty. His name is Connor, right? Yeah, it's Connor. Yeah. I I, don't, I didn't want to. Like, I was just like, oh my god, if it's not Connor, I'm fucked. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I really. Oh, it's I love him so much too. Yeah. I think he's a really, really, really sweet person. Yeah, he's great, but, but like, that's yeah. It's April first. Like, if if I don't like act like a bitch today, I don't know what when when right. Yeah. But this, this song is so insane. Yeah, it's really good. It's definitely one of my favorite releases for a while now. It's pretty pretty dope. Yeah, I like I'm it a lot. To my phone in a second. Let's see if Shark is in the outro again. But the worst sustains in the. Yeah, yeah. In the B section switch. And honestly, I have to say, um, I wouldn't connect Sultan with these type of sustain bases, so it might be Shaq, actually. Yeah. That's pretty... It's producing. That's now. pretty cool. Oh, like, like may maybe he's learning or something. Maybe he's learning and then collabing to get, like, better and stuff, but, I mean, if if he's doing that, I'm all in for it, like... Dude, I, I honestly love his existence. Yeah, yeah, he's just... It's him just being like, dude, I want to do dubstep, and that's what I want to do. No yeah. discussion, and he's just like... Yeah, he feels like yeah. a glitch in the system, you know? Like, he... He's just like, like, how did he get there? Yeah, <laughs> like, what happened? <laughs> uh, Seth, yeah, add it to the playlist, please. Thank you. Could we compare to some of his other collabs to see? Like, compare it to Eliminate's collab or something? No, just blue balling. Um, Not right now, I think, but... I, I just yeah, you think have, that you have to go in a bit to your show, but yeah, I think right. Yeah, we we can listen to one more. I think. Okay, cool. Yeah, that was pretty cool. 